Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Stardew Sundays uh, on this uh, very, very hot, very humid day today. Uh, at least if you're in the, uh, you know, northeastern United States. Uh, sorry, just trying to get a timer to reset. There we go. There we go. Now it's reset. Uh, so, yeah, welcome. Last we left off, decidedly less hot and humid here in the valley as it is winter time. Uh, we have, what is this? Potato. Getting a potato in the mail. Potato mail. I don't know. Um, all right. So last we left off, what did we do? What did we do? We, we did a bunch of stuff Got the greenhouse. We got bunnies. Um, and we did get down to level 100 in the mines. Um, so level, I, I think the mines go to level 120. And we uh, started planting some, uh, ancient fruit and, uh, the, the rare seed, whatever the rare seed turns into. I can't remember off the top of my head. Place some of this hay. So, um, this means kind of our course of action. We're really free to do whatever we want. Sweet gem berry. Thank you. Yeah, so I needed to, uh, I needed to just add a little bit of gain, uh, on the microphone. Um, and uh, I did a little check pre-stream, um, sounded much better. Um, oh, we also, it's still incubating. Demon chicken. The resident witch of Stardew Valley has braced, has uh, graced us with her presence and given us demon chicken. So uh, we will be raising one chicken of the underworld. All right, so we do still need uh, some of those Omni Geodes. We need one more. Um, we're going to put that in there. We also need refined quartz. So we need to start uh, fishing up trash, um, which is something that I never thought I would utter in Stardew Valley. But um, we, we don't have enough trash. All right, so we are going to turn in our mayo and our cheese. Um, potato is, well, I guess potato is going to stay in my pockets. Is. Oh, that's right. I need to turn in eggs to Gus. All right. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, it was one of those things where, like, I kept trying to figure it out uh, and be like, how how do I get trash? Uh, <laughs> just because, um, like I haven't been using the crab pots, uh, and completely forgetting that unless you have like one of the specific farms, um, which I don't, uh, for this playthrough, um, yeah, the, your own pond on, in the farm, uh, is a wonderful source of trash. So that's where we'll be going to get that. Uh, we're going to put a crab in there so that we can do uh, crab cakes. And I think. Yeah, we knew we need that red mushroom for the uh, the dye bundle. <clears throat> All 
We are not lucky today. Even with this. Okay. Okay. All right. Take a deep breath. Recenter ourselves. Got the got the <laughs> pre-stream jitters going. Um, all right, so let's check the cave. Wait, I think we already did check the cave, and I'm pretty sure there were cherries in the cave. Okay. All right. Uh, let's. Since we don't really have anywhere specific to be. Um, oh, you know what? We could upgrade one of our tools. We could do that. How many copper bars we got? Yeah. Let's go do that. We'll uh, go. We'll go play the pay the blacksmith a visit. Question is. Which tool? Wait, what? What? No! No! Where are you going? You just. Are you closed? I, what is even going on? <laughs> I guess we're not doing our upgraded stuff today. We're just. We're gonna go to the mines. That's irritating. All right, we'll see if we can uh, if we can get one Omni Geode that we can then feed to our sturgeon. And then we'll go fish up trash. We do have some food in case we start running out of energy. I expect it's going to take us quite a while to even get like five levels because uh, the spirits are unkind to us today. There we go. Not the geode we need though, but perhaps the geode we deserve. Magma bat. All right, come on. There we go. Some crispy bat wings. A uh, popular delicacy in the realm of Azeroth. Not so much in Stardew Valley. <laughs> Somehow we take bat wings and turn them into... Lightning rods? I, I don't quite know how that works. There we go. Bye. You can go away, please. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know what, uh, why Clint decided to just not be open today. That's weird. And not helpful. <laughs> like, I don't know. Don't complain if you're not making any money when you're not open. Especially when I'm trying to do the very thing that uh, you asked me to do. Ooh, I just got a nice breeze coming through the window. That was nice. That's nice. It was so, so humid out today. 
Like, it wasn't actually very hot. But up here in Western Massachusetts, we had 82% humidity. So, um, wasn't great. are going to have <clears throat> whatever this oh eggplant parmesan I think this is one of those meals that boosts your maximum energy So that'll that'll be really helpful for us um, and it is taking us a long time to progress through the mines Oh, the night market. Oh, dear. Um, okay. So, what we'll do is we'll see if we can progress. Um, can we build stairs? Yeah, we're, we're just going to do that. And we're going to go. <laughs> then we'll go to the bus stop. We'll head on down to the night market. We'll do some night fishing. Oh, no. Eggplant gives us mining and defense. Is what it looks like. Snow yam. Is that literally what I have? No. Okay. All right. So snow yams are the white ones then. They look like carrots. Still, I think that should be pretty easy to to do. What do we got here? Selling this painting for 1200. Sure. Yeah, we'll buy it. We got the money. Yes. We will absolutely buy some Iridium ore. Um, rare crow, uh, bok choy, beet seeds. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if we really need anything else. Um, we'll take the hash browns, actually. Oh, no. Uh, I don't have any room. Or, oh, you know what? Here's what we can do. We'll pay for the warp home. Unload this stuff. And then we'll use a beach totem to warp back to the beach. I was thinking with my big brain. All right, we're going to deposit. Nope, sap goes in the other one. Iridium ore. Still not enough to actually make an iridium bar, but that's okay. Um, we'll keep keep those copper bars. See if Clint's open tomorrow. Have any other geodes? Um, not seeing any. Okay. Uh, we'll put the fiber in there. We'll put the sap. Sell, sell. We'll sell that. We'll sell the holly. We'll sell the cherries. Okie dokie. Take the peach totem. Easy peasy. We'll just talk to people to uh, preserve their friendship. Yeah, 
we are we are absolutely taking the submarine tour. Now we wait. There we go. Oh no. Keep, I, every once in a while I forget that it's the Y button. Yay. <clears throat> Seaweed. Right, so what do we got going on here? fish. He's gone. All right, we can get maybe one or two more casts in. Because it takes uh, 30 minutes in game. the submarine to resurface. This must be a uh, super cucumber, I think. I bet it's a super cucumber. Oh! It's a blobfish. All that was for bait? Wasn't worth it. Was not worth it. At a certain point, I gotta I gotta craft a worm bin so that I have uh, lots of bait that's being generated. E, there we go. So this will be a this will be a good fishing haul for the day. Which will be good because any day that uh, is mining oriented is not a good day for uh, for money making. Are you a blobfish? Inquiring minds want to know, and you are. Okay, we will go back up. Do 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 do. Dancing around in circles. There we go. And then we will, uh... You know, if, if there was just, like, a vendor in town that would do that, that, like, wasn't restricted to the night market, uh, where they would send you back to your home for 250. I might use it all the time. <laughs> all of the time. Um, oh, I oh, hope we got some. We've got some caviar. 
Uh, we don't have any row to put in there. That's interesting. Is there any row down there? No, there's no row down there. Okay. We are going to put some hash browns in there, though. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll sell the caviar tomorrow. Five thousand, not bad, not bad. Oh, it is the wizard's birthday. All right. Oh. Lovely walk out here. I haven't seen this old farm in a long time. It looks even better than I remember. One gardener to another. Oh yay, little garden pot. Cool. Nice. Put you right in the corner. favor and you got a new hammer I want to try it on variety of metal can you smelt an iron bar and bring it to me I certainly can as long as you're going to be open today <laughs> <clears throat> um let's just smelt some more gold bars too Horsey time. <clears throat> horsey, horsey. See what's in the bat cave. Ooh, we got a. It's not a variety of things, but a uh, quantity of items. That's nice. Snow yam. There we go. Got the snow yam for Willie. Go check on our cow and our goat. There we go. And now for the chickens. Ooh, nice. So yeah, we are we are gonna forego mayo for the foreseeable future. So we can do uh Gus's request. Yeah, we've got twelve days to get eighteen eggs, but we make essentially three eggs a day. <clears throat> So, uh, we will definitely have that. We're just going to sell all the fruit, sell all the mayo, sell the cheese, sell the caviar. And let's go. Extra snow yam.
Oh, you know what? Let's, uh... There we go. Do that first. Process some geo. We got stone. Okay. Um... So the only problem is if we water or if we upgrade the watering can um I mean I suppose we could craft a sprinkler and and throw it in the greenhouse for now um cuz like we can do the trash can at any time um Yeah, let's do that. We'll do the watering can. All right, so we're going to hop back home. Because, um, number one, I forgot to check what was on the telly. It's a Queen of Sauce rerun plum pudding. The spirits are very, very displeased today. They will actively make our life difficult. Um, so today's not a day for going to the mines. Uh, let's see. Have a spare sprinkle. Oh, you know what? We'll just take one of these. It's not being used. <laughs> it, like it's they're not being used at all. There. Um so I think if it's Asmodeus's birthday. He probably likes amethysts, right? I'm gonna guess that he does. He's got the whole purple thing going on. And potentially that connection to Abigail. Um, we won't worry about um, trying to go find Willie because, like, he'll be at the saloon. Um, because especially during the winter time, like, when there's not much else to do, that's where everybody goes. Actually, speak the language requires a lifetime of devoted effort. Now, if you'll excuse me. All right, so Maru, Willie, where is Rasmodi? Rasmodi is probably or wizard, <laughs> just wizard down at the bottom. Deluxe Barn, probably next. Um, can't remember. Wow, it's only like a little bit after noon in game. Okay. Very efficient with our time. <laughs> Drop off these crystal fruit. Polly, the snow yam. <clears throat> we'll 
bar, stone. Um, actually, you know what? We can, we can phone Robin and see how much the deluxe barn will take to build. Let's see. Cabin, slime hunch, deluxe barn. 550 wood, 300 stone. Okay. Um, all right, we have the wood. <clears throat> Do we have the stone? We have the stone, so we just need the money. Okay. So really, that's all it is. It's, it's just a matter of money. Um... Yeah, I think we do a little bit more uh, mine exploration then. Nope, nope. You can stay over there, Mr. Shadow Spirit. got going on over here. Not a lot. Okay. If we can get one more Omni Geode, that would be great. And if we're not, then an exit would also be good. <clears throat> I, I would, uh, Except that. Oof. Well, uh, the spirits are very displeased today. No, oh, come back. so that I can uh, turn you into crafting materials. All that effort to go one floor. This is gonna be tough. Of mushrooms on this floor, though, so that's nice. Also, just realizing that, like, the uh, the cave aesthetic changed. So now I have the eternal dilemma of, do I just take the path down? Well, I believe that has made the decision for me. Uh, the dilemma was to if there's a path immediately available down, whether to take that path now <clears throat> or to try and fully explore and see what you might be missing. But uh, when there's going to be an enemy spawning event, yeah. Yeah, honestly, I think we prioritize getting checkpoints. 
that'll just make exploration easier. Space boots. So firewalkers plus three, plus three, plus four, plus four. <clears throat> we will exit. And then, uh... Go to the... Saloon, drop off the snow yam, and then to the night market. Our beloved Mona. There we go. I saw a snow rabbit. All right, we are going to just drop off eggs. It's a hassle to keep it clean. if they if Haley and Emily own that house or if they just rent it and if they just rent it who are they renting it from it's never made very clear oh we were we were going to go to the night market we'll just use a totem Yeah, we'll just we'll just deposit a bunch of this stuff and and then use a totem to get down there. Okay. Um. Well, I can't do anything about. We can, however, sell most of them. All right, so we should be able to still get like a little bit of uh, fishing in. Do we want this painting? Not really. Pork bobber. Um, sure. Baked fish. Wine. Fried eel. Uh, and the rare crow. Okay. Oh, they use out the seasonal plants. Okay. Hello, yes, I would like to catch deep sea fish, please. Thank you. Oh. There we go. All right. We might have to push it a little bit tonight. Since it is already 10.30 p.m. in-game time. Yes, perfect fish. So, I mean, we're just going to teleport back, so 
mean, we can we can definitely push it a little bit. Ooh, feisty fish. Oh. All right, so it's not perfect, unfortunately. The old midnight squid. Perfect midnight squid. There we go. Did uh, anyone catch D&D Live 2021 this weekend? With all of the different uh, book announcements and panels and such. I gotta catch most of them on, on VODs. Um, Alright, so we're... Um, particularly excited for uh, this year's assortment of books. Um, and we're going to talk about this more on the podcast on Wednesday. But uh, <clears throat> the fact that these books are going to put less of a focus on combat. Um, is pretty interesting. Right, we are not running back. <laughs> we are teleporting back. <laughs> then we're going to sell those fish. Okay, let's see how much money we made. Oh, cool. Now we can tr transmute stuff to gold. Sadly, I don't know if there's a transmute to iridium recipe. Wow. So it cost us a thousand to go fishing and we only made like 1200 in fishing. So we only made $200, 200 gold fishing. Okay. So that's something to keep in mind is like if you're going to do night market fishing, you want to go early. Give them their favorite gift on their birthday. All right, so the spirits are feeling neutral today. This bodes well. Thought I'd send you one. Maybe it'll help you make mine more ore or something. Algae soup. Feast of the Winter Star. It's a time for the community to come together and think back on all the good fortune we've had this year. A favorite tradition is the secret gift exchange where everyone in town is randomly assigned to someone else. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift for their secret friend and surprise them with something special. This year, our secret friend is... Vincent. Don't tell anyone. Okay. All right. This will be interesting. Um. Do I even have anything? Huh. I'm not sure what Vincent would like. I don't know. Like, outside of, like, 
Oh no, I can't give can't give the puppy water. Oh no. What if what if I put a sprinkler next to uh, the dog dish? Will, will that work? <laughs> uh, I can't imagine it would. But it's a funny thought. Alright, so milk. Goat's milk. We'll check to see if our evil chicken has hatched. got a duck feather today. Duck feather today. All right. Um let's let's check our recipes. Um let's see. Chocolate cake. We would need an egg. We would need an egg. Um, I think we can spare one singular egg to craft a chocolate cake. I think we can do that. I'm pretty, he's, he's gotta like chocolate cake. No, we don't want to eat the crocus. Come on. No. That's that's not right. <laughs> that's just that's they're not for eating, okay? They're not for eating. Right, like zero energy. So we won't be able to go check on that. Um, guess it's mining time. Hello, skeleton man. Or skeleton glass. Hey, now we can go uh, pay off the sturgeons. Like, some of the fish in the fish pond. You know, like, you give them stuff and they're like, oh, yes, this will help us grow and everything. And the sturgeons are like, yes, we want diamonds. Fine jewelry and imported gems. And it's like I don't think uh I don't think you as a species need that at all. I don't quite know what this is. Aquamarine, okay. to craft big bombs? We are able to craft big bombs. We need four iron ore. Okay. Because th this would be the ideal location for it.
so let's let's see. Okay, it's noon, not midnight. Noon. <laughs> There's a big difference. <laughs> So we just we gotta find exit strategy here. How many rocks do we have? Can we just create stairs. No, we cannot. It takes a whole bunch of rocks to make a staircase. Give me your power generators. Ooh, that's a lot of things. Dwarf scroll three. That's uh, the popular uh, Elder Scroll spinoff uh, where Everyone is, um, oh, I forget what the, Dwemer, we're all Dwemer. distinctly remember enemies like supposedly getting more difficult and it seems like it kind of capped out on like a threshold of enemies and I don't know if the types of enemies that spawn is directly related to your luck or not so like these are the enemies that normally spawn? Maybe these floors aren't so bad. This, I mean, this floor definitely can get behind it because we can sell a lot of these mushrooms. we already finished the foraging bundle, so, like, we don't need them for any, uh... I don't think we need them for any bundles. Specialty fish, that's the vault. Enchanter, that's just rabbit's foot. Oh, no, okay, so we will be able to do this for the field research bundle. Okay. We'll need the dye bundle, uh, and... Chef's bundle. Aha. All right. We got three floors to go. It is four twenty PM. do need energy, so I think it's time to eat the cranberry sauce. Which does give us mining. So any further mining exploits will uh, cost less energy. Or scroll three again. And that was that was such a great Dwemer adventure where uh, you would have to save uh, the city of the Dwemer from I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to think of like any other of the Daedra that you know haven't been used. 
Now begins the arduous task of breaking up these rocks. To, oh, do we have enough stone? We do. So instead of doing that, we're gonna make ourselves a set of stairs. And we're just gonna sort of cheat our way down to the bottom. enough to craft a bomba. Nope. Not enough to craft a bomba. I want to prioritize breaking up stuff that only takes a single hit. Since that is less energy and uh, you actually get experience for it. At least according to what I have read on the wiki. Oh boy. Uh we are, this I mean this is literally the last floor, and we are starting to get a little late, so uh any any time now. At this rate we'll be able to craft a set of stairs before uh We'll find a set of stairs. Wait, where'd those stairs come from? Okay. Skull key. So we can leave the mine now. Uh, we will go home. Actually, we will go uh, turn in some eggs. And we'll go... Actually, Are we able to give Willie another present? Yeah. It hasn't registered us uh, having given him any presents this week. Nope, we can't. All right, so we'll drop off the eggs first. Drop off eggs. And then... We are, oh, hello, what is this ring? Immunity band. Small magnet ring. Ah, like, I don't know if that'll be useful for other dungeons. Oh, so we already have this. Um, yeah, we're we're just gonna sell that. Uh, we're gonna sell fire quartz. Sell that. Sell you. Sell you. Um, let's see. You, you, you. Oh. Bones. Bat wings. Um, we do still have time, so let's... Oh. First, let's pay off the sturgeon. Bit 
There we go. Now we're gonna go catch some trash. We're gonna, we're gonna clean things up. But specifically, we need to find broken glasses. Any moment now. There we go. Um. Yeah, I mean, we're we're already home, so we'll keep at it. I wonder if you can put crab pots in this pond. Oh, broken CD. That'll that'll make refined quartz. There we go. Trash. Okay. This will be the last cast. Perfect. There we go. Perfecto. All right, so we have a whole bunch of stuff going right now. Boom. Okay, some decent money foraging. Yeah, not doing the mayo. Not selling mayo is is definitely hurting. Fortune teller. We are not lucky today. Okay. Lobster bisque. Nice. We're so close. So close. We'll get there. We'll get there. Buns starting to produce goods. Nice. Very nice. So, first rabbit's foot will go to the community center. We're going to keep the other one. for uh, our own purposes. For when we need a little bit of extra luck. find quartz for the farm computer, so we're going to hold on to them. Um, torches. Yeah, we are, we are going to go pick up our watering can. We'll do, we'll do the trash can last, because, I mean, that's, you know, really, like... Not 
Nice. Trash candy. So yeah, we'll get that upgraded. Um, community center. Um, we'll go back to the bus stop. Excuse me. Those purple shoes really stand out. I mean, they they are they are gaudy. <laughs> Uh, the arcane properties of the tuna. Well, I guess we're going fishing. So if he gives you 300, that ultimately means that tuna are only like 100? That doesn't seem right, because that seems really cheap for, you know, a fish that normally is quite profitable. Oh, no, 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 no. We can't, we can't eat the chocolate cake. We got to save that for Vincent. Never been married. I have no family. All I live for is to be mayor. That's not quite right. But, you know. Oh, we can finish. Uh... Wow, we've got quite a bit of got quite a bit of stuff going down on the beach. Actually, we haven't been over here in a while, so there's probably a whole bunch of coral. So we'll just go around. We'll pick up all the pretty coral and the and the shells. Actually, I'm pretty sure we can finish the um, field research bundle now. So we'll go do that. And then, uh, and then by that point, the saloon should be open. So we'll go drop some eggs off at the saloon. See who's there. Reward is friendship. Oh, sorry. So friendship is for the bulletin board. Uh, another recycling machine. We can certainly do that. We'll get good use out of that. Um, oh. Can we make the... We can make the worm bin. The worm bin requires hardwood. We have this. We can totally make a worm bin. And we should. Um, honestly, we should probably make two. Oh, there's nobody here. Man, nobody comes here for lunch? That seems wrong. But I'm I'm also gonna leave. <laughs> Mostly because. to brush my hair daily or else it'll clump up into messy knots. Okay. It's time for fishing. Beep. 
because uh, little did you know this is actually the Stardew fishing stream. <laughs> I think that would be an interesting playthrough. Is like uh, trying to have it be that 100% of your income. Uh, like you do the bare minimum to like clear out quests and stuff, but um, the primary source of your income is fishing. Which, I mean, is really only a slight modification to how I normally play. <laughs> so this, these are all, it's all mostly bait fish. Um, so very low value. Um, So fun fact is, depending on the professions that you pick for fishing, uh, like if you don't pick angler and whatever the other one is, where you just like keep increasing the value of fish that you sell, um, there are thresholds of fish on the lower end where it's more worthwhile to turn all the fish you catch into sashimi and sell that instead of like selling the fish outright. Whereas if you have those professions, then it becomes more valuable to sell the fish on its own instead of converting it to, to uh, sashimi. I also uh, am amused at the thought of like taking sardines and making sashimi mm -hmm. out of them. Stardew Fishing for me is one of the best fishing mini games. Um, sadly, I hope uh, I hope they bring like Breath of Fire three to what, Steam. Um, if it's not already on there, uh, because mm -hmm. that has been a fishing system that I've been very interested mm -hmm. in playing. I'd imagine it is also a prime contender for uh, for another good fishing mini game. Oh, I missed the window. These iridium quality uh, red mullets are definitely going to be worth a bunch. Oh, we missed that. Oh, that's it. Just a sardine. Not too concerned about it. I think another viable route for fishing is to do like the crab pot route and uh, like you pick the professions where you can't get trash anymore and then crab pots don't require bait.
Hey, tuna. There we go. Quickly, to the enchanted forest where we must deliver the tuna to the wizard so he may study its arcane mystery. I think if I were to ever like make a, a strategy guide or something uh, actually you know what hmm, maybe an adventure a fishing themed D&D adventure titled on the arcane mysteries of tuna And it's uh, an adventure revolving around fishing. <laughs> oh, my players would hate me. And we we might even get confirmation of that in the in the chat. <laughs> oh, you know what we can uh. Alright, so we got iron bars here. Let's sell some stuff, shall we? Clams. Um, we can turn clams into chowder. Or we can just sell them. For now, I'm I'm just gonna continue selling them. Um That is what we want. Oh, that's the problem is that, yeah, we need to we kind of need to move these things, so we can't place it in there. Um, we place them over here. We can. So yeah, let's place the recyclers over here. I'm gonna move the charcoal kiln. There we go. All right, let's put our broken CD. And uh, we can put you there. All right, so red snapper. Do, 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 do. Mayonnaise, tomato, starfruit, hazelnut. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think the starfruit might just be saving it for... Uh, there we go. Here we go. Put you in a box, put you in a box, put you in a box. When did we get pink cake? We got a free cake. I don't know where it came from. <laughs> huh. All right, we're, we're just going to sell the aquamarine. Um, let's see how the fishies are doing. Fish seem to be thriving. Very nice. Don't, um, wait, no, we can uh, we can fish for garbage. 
That's right, we can fish for garbage. That's what we want to be doing. Specifically, uh, busted CDs and eyeglasses. Okay, uh, just gotten driftwood. That's Joja Cola. Garbage, but not the useful kind. Man, what is with the driftwood? All right, did not really get a lot of useful stuff. Uh, how much hardwood do we have? We do have enough, okay. Um, and I, th I think it was a gold bar, gold bars for the old, for the worm bin. Oh. Cool. Those back. Put those back. Now the worm bin, um, we're going to put right behind our mailbox. A good place for it. Okay. Yeah, I can't really do anything else. Don't want it to get too, too late. So, boom. We are slowly but surely making our way up to 25 grand. It is Evelyn's birthday today. It's going to snow tomorrow. Spirits are in good humor today. Okay. That's good to know. We should, we should give Evelyn pink cake. I think she deserves one. She works hard. Let me through. A new chick hatched. It looks odd. Dare I say evil? Choose a name. Uh, we shall name this chicken. Uh, Griswolda. Did I get? Oh, no, I did. Okay. Yep. Four eggs. Nice. 
iridium quality milk should get us some nice quality cheese. And then that'll sell for uh, quite a bit of money. No fruit from the fruit bats. Eventually, we're going to cut all this back. Um, so those are growing. I think once we craft the deluxe barn, they're probably there. So we'll be able to like take all of our stone and start making like pathways with it. Um, and that'll be nice. That'll that'll look really good. Um, we're going to sell that. We're going to sell the cloth, actually. Um, we're just we're kind of more interested in making the money right now. In making the monies. All right, so we can find Evelyn at home, usually. So what do we got going on here? Uh, one crocus to Sebastian. I think we can probably manage that. Yeah. Nice. Um, all right, so we need to give Maru uh, a gift. So we'll wait until the saloon opens. We'll, we'll buy a pizza. I hope that she likes pizza. I can't remember if she likes pizza. Or if she's one of those folks in town that doesn't like pizza, Willie. Still working on my uh, gardening hoe? Yep. Okay. All right. Well, then... Um, Crocus. Okay, yeah, so we'll just uh we'll just wander around town. Since crocuses are um just a, a flower that appears, so there's not really any way to like cultivate them. Unless you use like the the sort of uh variety pack of seeds that you can get. But in order to do that, you also have to have a crocus in the first place. But it doesn't matter because, uh, man, Sebastian asked for crocuses, didn't bother to look like right outside his house. I can guarantee at 11 a.m. he's probably still at home. He's not. <gasps> uh oh. Oh dear. I don't know where he could be. Um All right. Where would he go? Well, it's a secret. Oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. All right. We are going to... <clears throat> it's Saturday, so I don't think Sebastian has a doctor's appointment. I also pretty sure we saw Harvey just, like, wandering around somewhere. Winter Saturday. All right, it's the 20th. Oh, okay. All right, so he's over at Sam's. All right, that that, I, that would make sense. They're probably doing band practice. Oh, he, here he goes. Let's see. 
frogs aren't very happy in winter. No. Nobody's very happy. Uh, well, there's not really a lot of animals that are very happy in winter. Like, there's some that aren't sad. But quite a few of them aren't happy. <laughs> All right, so we're, I mean, we're basically halfway there. Um, oh, right. Pizza. We'll see how this goes over. of your farming machines need to be fixed, just let me know. I hear y'all might be hungry. Okay. So, yeah, we'll just, uh, we'll go fishing again. Fish, fish, fish. Fishy, fish. Let's see. So Willie, I think, is in a shop. No, he's he is booting a boot. Well, good for him. I'll catch him at the uh, at the saloon later. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, oh no. We lost our bubbles. I'm going to redeem a thing. Boop. So, um, since we're on the topic of fishing and fishing, uh, What sort of a uh, camera equipment do divers use to uh, get footage of uh, underwater scenes? <clears throat> uh, they use microfiche. Oh, 
I'm sure I'm going to be hearing about that one. <laughs> uh, from, uh, from some of the folks in chat. <laughs> Whoop. Thought I had it. Thought I had that. See, microfiche. So uh, let's kick it up a notch with some of these uh, fish here. Give me something good, like a like a squid. It's not gonna be a squid. Nope. Boom. All right, we'll see what sort of treasure we get. Nice sea cucumber. Fire quartz, something that will actually sell for money. <laughs> instead of uh, instead of just being bait. Squirmy wormies. And the like. There's some tuna. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna break off from that. Doing a little indoor exercises since it's often too cold to go out. But you were just out. <gasps> Did we do it? Oh, we didn't. Ah, oh, we're so close. So close. We are going to go sell these fish. Actually, you know what I think it's time for? I think it's time for journey to the prayer journey of the Prairie King. No. <laughs> yeah, we're Let's start a new journey. That's a lot. Did we have bad luck today? Is it kind of, I mean that, that opening Uh, we're not going to start over again. But, um... Yeah. No. Alright. Yeah, we're, we're done. <laughs> yeah. 
That that's not happening. Something you want to talk about? Uh Also, yeah, that's where I redeemed a channel point reward on my own channel. I can do that. I have infinite channel points. Because that's how that works. Sell all the fish. Oh, and actually we're going to sell that fire force too. Uh, and then... Clean up. Soggy newspaper. We're hoping for broken CDs or uh, eyeglasses. Broken CD. Broken eyeglasses. Yes. We need that refined quartz to uh, to make the computer. Which is funny because like the farm isn't really big enough yet to benefit from having the computer? But, you know, it'll still be something. I have run out of bait. Okay. Okay. All right, fishing more soda out of the junk pond. Anything else we can sell? We can sell the Joja Cola. It doesn't sell for a lot, but we can do that. Throw those in there. And grab one more of those. And we will throw that wood in there. Um, oh! We can make algae soup. Or pale soup. Or pale broth. Wait. We're already able to make pale broth. We want to make algae soup. Which we need that to do. Because, mmm, algae soup, that sounds great. <laughs> uh, some cranberry jelly. Which is different, different than cranberry sauce, apparently. At least for this game. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll keep these. Delicate broth with a with a hint of sulfur. Yes, because when I think, hmm, <coughs> what is a what's a what's a great flavor for a soup that I want? It's uh sulfurous. All right, we are going to go to bed. I think we can squeeze in one more day of playtime. 
um, before we call it a night. Maybe. Maybe. Um, yeah. I think we do. Queen of Souse. Pumpkin pie. There we go. Now we have a reason to save pumpkins. Spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Uh, which is their sort of default stance with me, it seems. Uh, ten pieces of hardwood. Yeah, we can do that. Grab some of our sturgeon row. Oh, do we have a thing open? We don't have a thing open. All right. Check the chickens, and the ducks, and the bunny. Little bunny. And our little evil chicken. Oof. Did we really not get anything from the ducks? Ow. All right then. Tar. <laughs> when the uh, when the greenhouse is much more up and running, we'll uh, definitely set up more casks. Um, and we'll use a lot of the pine tar for that. Hello, dog. No spice berry. Let's see, do we need to fill the we do. Ten pieces of hardwood. Turn that in, deposit that. I mean, we're, we're slowly getting there. We're at 21. I mean, there's probably a bunch of these gemstones in here that we could just sell off. Like, could do that. Sell off one of these. Um... The jade, we could sell off one. We could sell off one topaz. Three emeralds. Just, you know, kind of up the ante a little bit on our uh, income production. Oh, we can also pick up our gardening hoe. Yeah, so we'll we'll go do that. Nice, a little bit of extra cash. Can we already give. 
so is Maru like? Uh, I can't imagine that anybody would would choose to have either of those suits, except for like maybe Linus. I I can't in good conscience give those suits to anybody as a gift. I really don't want to. Uh, who catches three pike, uh, we can certainly do that. Absolutely. Uh, we can even do that while waiting for the saloon to open so that we can buy another pizza. Want to toss out the eggs? Thank you. And now we wait. Tiger Trout. That's interesting. Come on. Show me Pike. Ooh. Could be Pike. Might still be Tiger Trout. Use the last piece of bait. <clears throat> Yeah, honestly, um, let's, uh, let's go see Willy, and we'll buy some bait, and we'll buy a bobber. I'm gonna buy 200 pieces of bait. We're around there. We'll see how, how quickly I can stop. There we go. Oop. I got stuck. All right, give me Pike. Let's see it. Let's see it. Come on. Ooh, train's passing through. Perch. That would have been great uh, during the community project where I had to fish up all the perch and then perch all of a sudden, despite being overpopulated, stopped showing up. And now I guess they're overpopulated again. Oh, it's Sunday, so everybody's stuff reset. Okay. Right. For real? We're gonna we're gonna come back to the fishing. We're gonna come back to that. Because we gotta do uh some pizza delivery. Seeds. So yeah, the goal is, uh, oh, there you are. Oh, did we do it? 
Did we do it? We did it! Woo! Nice. Cool. I believe that means all of the... Uh, eligible bachelorettes are maxed out now. Um, yes. So we're just going to go back to fishing. Nice, relaxing time. What kind of fish are you? Hey, there's one. will take extra bait. I will definitely take extra bait. Uh, this is likely not a pike. This might be a perch. So fish in Stardew Valley, each one has a different pattern. Um, and there's like a couple different kinds of patterns. Um, but like, you know, all perch will follow the same general pattern type. You know, and all pike will follow the same general pattern type. This is ling cod maybe? Yeah. So you can tell, like, uh, like carp, most times, uh, you may never have to even touch the button. This is a very easygoing sort of bottom dwelling, like bottom feeder fish. There's two. Let's see, this could be another one. Or, uh, this might be Linkod. Jumping around an awful lot. That's okay. It's a, I mean, not super valuable, but it sells pretty well. Like it has a good combination of a fairly common enough catch rate um, with like, you know, a moderate sell value. There we go. We will go see Willie. Actually, do we just talk to him? Yeah, we do. You get to keep the fish. Perfect. Perfect. So it's just straight up rewarding me for what I was going to do anyway. <laughs> Saw nothing.
All right, who is up next? Uh, Robin is up next. Um, okay. It's Robin and Evelyn. Why are you telling me not to make a mess in the house? This isn't your house. Do I ever take the whole day off? Um, yeah, so that's weird because like, what I do on my not day off, like a regular work day for me is like what most people do on their day off, so. hard to tell, like, what would be considered a day off or not. Okay. So we'll go sell these. And then just run around, uh, digging up stuff around town. <laughs> Oh, right. Fishing up trash. I keep forgetting that, like, fishing up trash is a thing that I specifically said I wanted to do. Um, yeah, I feel like converting this stuff to soup is probably worth more than just selling it outright. kind of gnarly old digging tool. All right. So yeah, this doesn't put us too far um, past uh, our normal ending time. So. And we're just gonna we're just gonna fish up garbage until it's time to uh, go to bed. Broken eyeglasses. There we go. Just general trash. So general trash uh, can be like you can potentially get iron from it. Um, driftwood is likely just to turn into wood or torches. Uh, newspaper mostly turns into torches, but has a very low chance of turning into cloth. So that's super useful. But um, really the useful ones are the, the broken CD and the, uh, the eyeglasses. Because there's really no other way to get refined quartz. Whereas all of the other items, you know, they, they give you materials that like you can easily acquire. And except for iron until you're later in the game. But at this point, like for us, it's very easy to get iron. Okay. Here we go. We will 
certainly sell that. And actually, we're, we're just going to sell those two. Um, and we're, we're going to sell this extra LG soup as well. There. Boom. Easy peasy. Let's see how much money we made. More on mining than we did on fishing. Oof. Oof. Uh, and oh, it's going to be close. You might be just short. We are just over. There we go. All right. So uh, next session, then deluxe barn. So um, speaking of which, uh, there will not be a Stardew Sundays next Sunday, um, as my wife and I will be on a um, little weekend trip. Um, but, uh, if you're watching on YouTube, thank you for joining me and, uh, we'll see you next time.